guys welcome to my youtube channel it's your girl nana afro and i'm here with another video how am i busy <laughs> the last time i posted was like is it last year last year in september or october but i wasn't getting the time because of you know wasi and i wrote nobdek in form to nobdek and then wasi which was this year so today i'm going to be doing a story time a story time on how i joined dwp and then my current life now like my current social life now with them for those of you who do not know DWP Academy, DWP Academy is a popular dance group in Ghana, and I don't think it's only in Ghana, like worldwide now. They are worldwide now. Yeah, it's a popular dance group. They train people, they train dancers, you know. That's that's the DWP Academy. Its full name is Dance with a Purpose. So they basically like train people, learners, beginners, like yeah. <laughs> i'm so excited that today i've had enough time to sit down and make a video like for real i'm always not getting time and anytime i'm ready to do it too something comes up but today i'm making a video so let's get back into the video yeah so actually before i started dancing i was making tiktok videos like just for fun like i'm like I didn't even know dance as a profession at that time. I had just completed my junior high school. That was in 2020, September 2020. And I was doing more of TikTok videos. And, you know, until I met somebody, I'm not going to mention his name. And that will be a talk for another time. Yeah, I met somebody who is a dancer, became a thing. And I started going for his dance class. And, yeah. When I got into senior high school, people like saw me as a dancer. I wasn't even confident in myself, you know, being saying I'm a dancer. I wasn't I wasn't confident. I wasn't so confident. But you know, people were calling me dancer, hey, she's a dancer, you know, this. They asked me, so where do I dance? I'm like, incredible ziggies, <laughs> you know, group like those. So he's a close friend of Incredible Ziggy. So I didn't know the name of his dance group, so when they asked me, I was like, Incredible Ziggy's people, you know, yeah. So, because of him, I used to go for dance class, but I didn't I wasn't dancing, like, I couldn't dance, you know. Mm. And my, my, my social media started growing, it was growing, like, well, like, healthy. <laughs> my Instagram, my TikTok, my YouTube especially. Okay, my YouTube started growing the next year. So, this was in 2021, actually. The whole of 2021 was like quite a journey for me. It was quite a journey for me. Me going here with this person, going here with that person. I had a surprise birthday party too, where some dancers came, came to this day, you know. My birthday, like people saw it, people saw it. I did that Port Belly Shack. It was a surprise birthday party for me, planned by my mom and him. Yeah. So yeah, people saw it. My followers were growing. Anytime I post, hey, I'm getting views. Hey, na 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 is growing in the social media realm. Then in August 2021, I went back to school. And a whole lot of issues happened concerning me and the dancer. Like, it was a whole lot for me. Like, during August to December, like, someone overdosed me. Someone overdosed me. <laughs> if you're watching this, I've forgiven you. <laughs> it 
it was it was like a hard time for me just because of some silly rumors that were going on about me and then the dancer yeah when i got home there's this guy i'm sure you guys know him real afro ot i'll put his picture up there yeah so real afro ot and then afro network i also put his picture here afro network you know we were social media friends or oh, we are social media friends they texted me and invited me to come to their dance class and i'm like okay since i've let this dancer's dance class let me join dwp and i felt like it would just be a one day thing i'm not going to you know be going consistently like it was just that day that i was going so when i got home i told my mom mommy this this time the year this 25th year as a gift to myself because of what i've gone through in school i'm going to dwp academy i'm going to just like dance there for a day and and she was like okay so i went with my sister i went with my sister and then at that time there were at job that was in december 2021 25th December 2021. I remember the date. So they were at Jolu Fiesta Royal New Grooming Center around that time. They were actually located at New Grooming Center, the gym there. So I went and gosh, I was shy. I'm a shy person. Like I'm always indoors, so I'm not really used to like socializing with people. And I was so shy, like shyness had never gripped me like that before i was so so shy so i was sitting at the reception didn't know what to do i called afro network he was like he couldn't make it afro ot was in there but i couldn't go in there to you know go and call him it will be some way so then i i walked inside just to peek on like what they're doing and i saw Afro Nita and then Champion Rosie dancing. I'm like, she's no, I'm not going inside. I am so shy. I'm going to sit down till they are done. <laughs> then my money is wasted. <laughs> so I was sitting there when um, Afro Beast came in with Yo Freak Green and Mr. Showtime. He came in and he was like, why am I sitting there? And I was like, oh, I'm shy. I can't go inside. And I was like, oh, no, I should just get up and go. I shouldn't be shy. So then I followed them inside. And I didn't know anybody there. So I didn't know what to do. I was like, gosh, God, please help me. Please help me. This is my time. This is, please help me. And then he told me to put my bag down and I put my bag down, told it to put my phone down, and then stand in front as um, Yofi Green teaches. That day, Yofi Green taught um, Mona Lisa, the Mona Lisa dance challenge. And because I was also shy, I couldn't pick up the dance steps. And mind you, the dance classes I had been going for, like, back at that dancer's piece, like, it wasn't... Their teaching was didn't really help me i don't know for others but it didn't really help me so so yofi green was teaching and i was just looking like hey, so if i make this mistake go up if i do this so i was so like you know shy i was acting so timid and you know after finished teaching then we rehearsed and then it was time for enjoyment yard the op has this thing where you dance now now they only promote solo dancing at first you can dance with as like a group like two people four people so they have this thing called enjoyment yard where they all gather around you you dance they record you as like and then you they'll be hyping that's how it was and i'm like no i can't shoot this video i'm a fresher i don't know anything I don't know anything about dance like so i was like okay then we closed i took some pictures i, I saw dance board he came in 
took some pictures with that's good i'll put all of them up there for you all to see yeah i took some pictures with that's good um official starter ritual yeah yeah then after the dance class on that 25th my first time at dwp afronita told me to start coming for um wednesday dance class too mm, i was like okay but even that i've never been up to now i've never been for wednesday dance class because of the time it's actually from 6 p.m to 8 30 p.m and i live at tema my mom is going to be so overprotective you know so yeah up to now i'll go for saturday dance class and tuesday when they have a members rehearsals i like to go and shoot content yeah now i think dwp has changed a little bit not in a bad way but i think it's, a, it's in a good way yeah then so that's how i actually like joined dwp then in the following year that was 2022 january i was like okay let me start going for their dance class i was contemplating because ot kept stressing on me coming for dance class ot kept stressing on me coming for dance class so one time this saturday i went but i didn't dance i only sat there looking at how they were dancing admiring how they were dancing like oh my god <laughs> i love the Olympia academy so much and i was just wishing the best for them i actually didn't know that they auditioned like people to become members until was it last year december yeah last year december so yeah i started going for their dance class and because of shs too i wasn't too consistent because i'm a bother i went to school came back in april may and yeah i was a bit consistent like i was going all the time i started shooting videos shooting videos and there was this guy afro jaron how can i forget him bye jaron <laughs> jaron if you're watching this <laughs> yeah so actually jaron was the first person i shot shot a video with people will say it's prince tokyo the christiata in dwp academy so it's actually like this i was the first but no jaron was the first person i shot a content with but then i was the first person prince tokyo shot a content with that's how it is actually i don't know if you guys understand yeah I posted it on my YouTube shorts actually. I wasn't thinking it would I like, go far, you know. When when we met for this content, he was like I should start posting on my YouTube and so that was my actual first content I posted and it had like a hundred thousand views and my 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 YouTube started growing. So I started creating more content with him and other people in DWP shooting videos posting on my youtube short and it was actually doing well it was actually doing very well i said dwp is a very good academy for um, beginners or learners yeah because the way they teach is so like good they are very good teachers and i like how they maintain their standards especially their manager is so he's a very good manager Quapos, he's a very good manager and i like how the group respects itself i like how the group respects itself so actually people think i'm a member i'm not a member i've never auditioned before <laughs> i am so shy i am very very shy and at the time i joined dw by now i should have gone like very far very far and i should have been a member but you know Due to my shyness and all those things like lack of confidence i'm actually working on it but it has like you know mellowed me a bit yeah so that is it i think that is it so that's how i actually joined dwp i'll be doing another story time 
we'll be doing another story time but if you haven't watched my my first story time just leave this video and <laughs> go and watch it before you come and continue this one just kidding before before i end this video i like you guys to like right now like like subscribe right now subscribe and then turn on post notifications so anytime i post you don't miss it love you guys and share it too i forgot to add share it share it to your friends your family like yeah i'll be doing another story time and i think the next post will be a vlog yeah vlog so yeah stay tuned